Okay, good evening, Ben. Okay, good evening. Okay, so now, Ben, let's move to cat point two. Ah, sorry, cat two point two. So, oh my god, ouch. Okay, cat. 2.2. Okay, let's move to cat 2.2. Okay. I will share you the screen. Oh, what's that? Today's this. Oh, who's special this today? Your day. Okay, who's special day is today? Okay. Okay, so now Ben, let's move to cat 2.2 listening test. Okay, go Ben. I know you can do it. Okay. I am excited. You go to pet. Pet is quite hard. Okay. So now before we go there, let us have this weather vocabulary. So in the weather vocabulary, of course, we have lots. Of course, we're going to talk about weather. What is it with weather? It's sunny, cloudy, rainy, lightning. Okay, all of this band are symbols. Okay, they are all symbols with the weather. Okay, so we have sleet, sleeting. So storm, lightning, thunder, hail, wind, fog. Okay. So all of this are part of what we call weather. So when we mentioned here sleep, oh, that's weather vocabulary, everything about weather. When we mention cold teacher, warm, freezing, that's weather vocabulary. So what we are talking or what you have seen here in the screen are all weather vocabulary. It talks about weather. Okay? Right, Ben? Okay, Ben? Okay. So now let's have this. Okay. For questions, we have five conversations. You will hear, of course, they are talking here okay, about the different things. Please try to listen. Don't say, teacher, finish. You have, as the rules, you have to listen it two times. Okay, ready? Oh, I hear. I hear the dog is barking. Okay, Ben, by the way, whose special day is today? Your birthday? No. What's with today? What's today? You said it's special. Why? Why it's special? 
see in the jack box. Ah, in the no, it's in the, it's only one. Wait, wait. Ah, Can you see it's again? your dad's. Yeah, your dad. How old is your dad? Twenty-two. Twenty-two. Forty-two. Forty-two. Yeah. Okay. How about your mom? How old is your mom? Forty. Forty. Ah, your mom and I, we have the same age. Wow. Yeah. Okay. So listen. Now we're ready to start. Look at question one. One. How will Mary travel to Scotland? Are you taking the train to Scotland tomorrow, Mary? No, I'm driving there. It's cheaper. Why don't you go by coach? Oh, no. It takes seven hours. Now listen again. Are you taking the train to Scotland tomorrow, Mary? No, I'm driving there. It's cheaper. Why don't you go by coach? Oh, no. It takes seven hours. Two. Where are the shoes? Mum, have you seen my brown shoes? Yes, they're under the table. No, they're not. I left them on the chair this morning, but they're not there now. There they are, under the window. Now listen again. Mum, have you seen my brown shoes? Yes, they're under the table. No, they're not. I left them on the chair this morning. But they're not there now. There they are, under the window. Three. When will the football match start next week? Does the football match start at quarter past twelve every week? No, it was early this week. It usually begins at two o'clock. So... It'll be the usual time next week. Yes. Now listen again. Does the football match start at quarter past twelve every week? No, it was early this week. It usually begins at two o'clock. So, it'll be the usual time next week? Yes. Four. Which box of chocolates do they buy? Which box of chocolates shall we get Mum for her birthday? Those round boxes with the flowers on Yes, but that square box is cheaper. But it's Mum's birthday. Let's get the big round one. We've got enough money. OK. Now listen again. Which box of chocolate shall we get Mum for her birthday? Those round boxes with the flowers on are nice. Yes, but that square box is cheaper. But it's Mum's birthday. Let's get the big round one. We've got enough money. OK. Five. When's Wendy's birthday? Wendy, you're 21 on Saturday, aren't you? No, my birthday's on May the 18th. Well, Saturday is the 18th. No, it's not. It's the 16th. Now listen again. Wendy, you're 21 on Saturday, aren't you? No, my birthday's on May the 18th. Well, Saturday is the 18th. No, it's not. It's the 16th.
This is the end of part one. Okay, Ben, what is the answer for number one? Okay, what's the answer for number one? Okay, so how will Mary travel to Scotland? Okay. Teacher, it's my boss. By a car or by a train, teacher Ann? It is letter B, teacher. Correct. Ben, very good. Oh, my God. Teacher used to open that one. Where are the shoes? Where are the shoes? It's letter A. It's near the window. Okay, next one. Okay, number three. When will the football match start next week? When will the football match? It's at 2 p.m. teacher. Okay, let's see. Very good. Now, which box of the chocolates do they buy? Which box of the chocolates do they buy? B. Letter B. Next. 16. When when this birthday? When? It will be on May 18. May 18 is when this birthday. Okay. Is that your answer, Ben? Ben, is that your answer? May 18? Is that your answer? Okay, very good. Okay, do you have a lot of visitors there? Okay, next one. Let's move. For part two, question six to ten, Ben, you have to listen to Pat talking to a friend about his holiday. What was the weather like each day? For question six to ten, write the letter A to H next to each prison. You will hear the conversation why okay listen now look at part two listen to pete talking to a friend about his holiday what was the weather like each day for question 6 to 10, write a letter, A to H, next to each day. You will hear the conversation twice. Hi Pete, you're looking well. Yes, I've just been on holiday in the mountains for a week. You must have had good weather. Well, not really. When I arrived on the Monday, it was very cold. It can be cold in the mountains at this time of the year. Yes, it wasn't very nice, really. Then, on Tuesday, it was so windy. I just stayed in the hotel all day. Did the weather get better? Well, Wednesday was a bit better. There wasn't a wind, and it was sunny most of the day. So, did you do a lot of walking? No. By Thursday, it was very cloudy and it looked as if it was going to snow. <laughs> and did it? No, but on Friday it rained a lot. And what about your last day? Well, the weather was getting better, and it was quite warm then, but it was a bit too late. Now listen again. Hi, Pete. You're looking well. Yes, I've just been on holiday in the mountains for a week. You must have had good weather. Well, not really. When I arrived on the Monday, it was very cold. It can be cold in the mountains at this time of the year. Yes, it wasn't very nice, really. Then, on Tuesday, it was so windy. I just stayed in the hotel all day. Did the weather get better? Well, Wednesday was a bit better. There wasn't any wind. And it was sunny most of the day. So, did you do a lot of walking? No. By Thursday, it was very cloudy, 
and it looked as if it was going to snow. And did it? No. It rained a lot. And what about your last day? Well, the weather was getting better, and it was quite warm. It was a bit too late. This is the end of part two. And now let us have here for six to ten. So we have here the different weather. Okay, in the right, in the left, we have here the day. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. We have here the days. In the other left here, we have the different weather. So let us match what weather is it on Tuesday. Okay, what weather? What weather is it on Tuesday? The weather in Tuesday is what then? It's wind. Okay, letter six. Uh, letter six, sorry, number six. No. Okay, it's letter no, H. Two. Letter H. It's windy. Okay, how about Wednesday? What do you think is the weather? Mm, I think it is cloud. It's cloudy, teacher. Letter F, sunny. Oh, you're not listening, Ben. Okay, next, how about Thursday, teacher Anne? What do you think is the weather, teacher Anne, on Wednesday? On Thursday, rather. Cloud. It's cloudy. It is. It's cloudy, teacher Anne. It's cloudy. Okay. So it is cloudy, teacher. Okay. It's cloudy. Okay. The weather is cloudy. Letter A. Very good. Now about Friday. What do you think? What do you think is the weather on Friday? Friday, the weather is? It's. Oh, it's letter D. It's rainy. On Friday, teacher, it is rainy bad on Friday. Okay, next. Saturday, teacher, that's weekend. We don't need to go to school. What do you think is the weather on Saturday? What do you think is the weather on Saturday? <laughs> what do you think is the weather on Saturday? Go, Ben. G. G. Letter G. Okay. Okay, it's letter G. Sorry. It is warm. The weather is warm, teacher. The weather is warm. Okay, Ben. Very good. Yay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, one more minute. Okay. Okay.
Okay. Hi, Pete. You're looking well. Okay, so we are here for questions 11. So we are done with 6 to 10. So now let's move to 11 to 15. You listen to my Carol talking to Marina about a new sports center because they love to go there and to make themselves fit. So they are very excited about the new sports center in which they can do the exercise. Okay, so let us listen and please try to check a, B, and C. Okay. Now look at part three. Listen to Michael talking to Marina about a new sports center. The questions 11 to 15, take A, B, or C. Hear the conversation twice. Look at questions 11 to 15 now. You have 20 seconds. Now listen to the conversation. Hello, Marina. Have you been to the new sports centre yet? No, Michael. Where is it? In Long Road. You know, near Bridge Street, behind the station. Oh. Is it good? Yes, it's great. You can do a lot of sports. I played table tennis and volleyball last week. What about tennis? Not yet. They're going to build some tennis courts next year. Is it expensive? Not really, Marina. It's £50 a year if you're 15 to 18, and £30 if you're under 15. Oh, that's good, because I'm still 14. And on Tuesday, Thursday and Friday, it stays open late, till 10 o'clock. Oh, great. How did you get there? I got the number 16 bus. It's only 10 minutes from the bus station. Do you want to go next week? OK. Any day except Thursday. Well, why don't we go on Friday? Then we can stay late. Yes, OK. Let's meet after school. Now listen again. OK. Marina, have you been to the new sports centre yet? No, Michael. <laughs> what sport can't you do at the sports center? What is it that you can't uh, B? Letter B. B, teacher, it's table tennis. Now look at part oh, three. Letter <laughs> Oh, Ben, it's letter mm -hmm. A, not letter B. Okay. Okay, next. Okay. How much must Marina pay in a year? C. Letter C, that's 50 pounds a year. Oh, it's letter. The answer is letter B. Now, how about 13? How many days a week is the sports center open late? B. Letter B. Okay, it's letter B, three times a week, 14. Which bus goes to the sports center? Which bus goes to the sports center? Which bus? It's letter number? 16. 16. And when will Michael and Marina go to sports center? When? C. Letter C, teacher, that is Friday. Okay, so they are talking here about Marina and Michael that the sports that they can't do is table tennis. Okay, and then they have to pay 30 pounds a year for them to join. Okay, 
And next one, letter B, 14, number 16. And let 15, when will Ma Michael and Marina go to Sports Center? It will be on Friday. Okay. Okay, next, man. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay. For 16 to 20, Ben, hey, you will hear a conversation about the flat for rent. Okay, you know what is flat, right? Apartment. Apartment or flat for rent. Okay, for rent, you have to pay. Um. Yes. So, this is an apartment for rent. Okay, so you know what is that, the flat? It's a big building. I know you're not living a flat. You're living in the house, right? Not a flat. You're living yeah. in the house, not a flat. Okay. So we have here. Listen. Now look at part four. You will hear a conversation about a flat for rent. Listen and complete questions 16 to 20. You will hear the conversation twice. Hello, Lawn Flats Agency. Can I help you? Oh, yes. My name's Mark Jones. I'm phoning about the flat for rent in Putney. I saw the advertisement in the paper. In Putney? Well, yes, Mr. Jones, that one's got two bedrooms. Are they double bedrooms? One double and one single. Okay. And how much is the rent? Well, it's £440 a month. I see. And where exactly is it? It's number 27, Beersley Street. Oh. How do you spell that? Beersley. It's E-A-R-S-L-E-Y. It's near the train station. And what floor is it on? It's a second floor flat. Has it got any furniture? Yes. It's got some nice modern furniture. Well, it sounds interesting. I'd like to see it, please. Can you come tomorrow? Tomorrow? That's Tuesday? Mm-hmm. Well, only after five o'clock. How about half past five? Yes, that's fine. Oh, one thing I nearly forgot. When will the flat be free to rent? From the 1st of March. Okay. See you tomorrow. Bye. Okay. Now listen again. Okay. So we are here. Okay. Now here, Ben. This is about lawn flats. Okay. So for a minute, just a minute, Ben, you wait me. So now we are talking here about the flat teacher and for rent. Okay, loan flat teacher for rent. Okay. Loan flat for rent. Okay. So now we have here the loan flat for rent. Okay. So here, number of bedrooms. Two. Now look at part four. Okay. There are two bedrooms teacher. One double, one single. The cost. How much that is cost? Four hundred. Um, I don't know. I don't know, right? Okay, it's four hundred. <laughs> it is. How much is it? Okay, it is four hundred forty. Yeah. Teacher and four hundred forty. Next, 
the address what is the address then i don't remember i don't remember teacher the address is oh i told you to repeat it okay the address is earthly okay the address is earthly and to when to see the class when it's 5 30 tuesday okay and free from march band so this is what teacher Ann told you you have to double check that okay for question 21 to 25 okay you will hear ben a tour guide talking about the day trip you listen ben and complete the questions Okay, again, this time, you listen twice so you can hear properly, okay? Please listen twice on this one. Now look at part five. Okay. You will hear a tour guide talking about a day trip. Listen and complete questions 21 to 25. You will hear the information twice. Hello, everyone. I just want to tell you about our trip to the town of Chester. The coach will leave at 9.15 tomorrow morning. It takes about an hour and a half to get to Chester, so we will arrive at a quarter to 11. You will have time for a cup of coffee before our first visit. This will be to the castle. It is a very interesting old building, and I'm sure you'll enjoy the visit. Tickets for the castle cost £3.50 for adults, and if you have children, a family ticket is just £8. There are lots of things to see, and we will be there about two hours. We will take sandwiches for lunch with us, and we will all eat together in a pub. You will be pleased to know that tomorrow is going to be sunny. After lunch, we will walk around the old market. You will be able to buy all your presents there. Now, any questions? Now, listen again. Hello, everyone. I just want to tell you about our trip to the town of Chester. The coach will leave at 9.15 tomorrow morning. It takes about an hour and a half. Chester, so we will arrive at a quarter to 11. You will have time for a cup of coffee before our first visit. This will be the castle. It is a very interesting old building and I'm sure you'll enjoy the visit. Tickets for the castle cost £3.50 for adults, and if you have children, a family ticket is just £8. There are lots of things to see, and we will be there about two hours. We will take sandwiches for lunch with us, and we will all eat together in a park. You will be pleased to know that tomorrow is going to be sunny. Oh, that's really After lunch, we will walk around the old market. You will be able to buy all your presents there. Now, any questions? Okay, now, Ben. Okay. This is the end of part five. You now have eight minutes to write your answers on the answer sheet. Okay, this is trip to Chester. Teacher, okay. stop the tape here and time eight minutes. Okay, so we are here. Trip to Chester. So, the coach will leave 9.15 a.m. That's too, it's not that too early, it's not that too late. It arrived at Chester what time? What time will it arrive at Chester? I don't know. It's too hard. It's too hard. Okay. Okay. In cat, that's too hard too. In cat. Okay. It's 
10.45, quarter to 11. Okay, we will practice. We will have to cut and cut and cut. Okay, next time we will cut. I know it's hard for you because this is quite first. But don't worry. As you go on the cat, you will master this. Tell me, Ben, if teacher is wrong. You will master this and you will be very good. Okay. Morning visit to what time, Ben? Yes. Morning visit is the castle. Okay. It's the castle, teacher. Ben. The price of family tickets? Okay. It's, so, it's eight pounds, teacher. Oh, is that your brother? Your sister? No, my sister. Oh, hi. Good evening. Okay. It seems that there's a lot of people in your house. Today is the party yeah. of your dad. Okay, next one. Lunch. Where is the lunch in? Where? Park. Park. It's in the park, teacher Anne. And afternoon visit. Afternoon visit is? It is okay. It is uh, an old market. It's an old market teacher and wait, wait for a while. Okay, it's an walked to around the old market teacher. Okay, walking around the old market. Okay, Quan, I'm Quan, sorry. Okay, Ben. Yeah, very good. Okay. So I know I understand Ben if you feel hard, quite hard because. I know this is cat, but when you go pet, okay, you can say teacher Anne, it's so hard, but you will be mastered. You will be very good in cat, in pet. There is a lot of questions that will make you okay. I will encourage you, Ben, to take exam with a pet. Okay, one of my students take exam with a pet. I encourage you to take exam with a pet. Okay. So now here, very good, Ben. Yay. Okay. Now here. Let's move to the next. Okay. Oh, this is the end of Cat 2.2. Okay. So next time, okay, 2.2. So by the way, do you find it hard, quite hard, Ben, for you? Or yeah. no? It's not, no, it's not hard. You even all, you know what is the secret? You only have to listen carefully. That's all. Just listen carefully. And everything will be okay. Listen carefully. Just listen carefully. Okay, I tell you. Just listen and everything will be okay. Trust teacher. Okay? I know you're a very smart boy. I can see that you're very smart. Okay? So, don't need to worry because i know you're smart okay so okay on we still have four minutes we will add that four minutes on sunday on sunday we will start 7 30. is teacher and correct 7 30 a.m yeah okay i will see you at uh what's that 7 25 so we have to go early in the class like 7 25 is it okay for you yeah okay very good so i will see you 7 25 on sunday okay ben okay ben is that okay for you is that okay for teacher okay okay oh what are you eating you're eating the pencil Okay, tonight, Ben, Julian is trying to help me uh, arrange the party things. Like, like these cups. Ben, we sell this one. This is our business. We sell this. Party needs and the balloons and everything. Of course you eat it. Yeah, we have a lot. I'll wait for a while. I will show you just a minute. Yeah, like this. Teacher Anne is selling this. Some kind of balloons, the different balloons. We sell this. We put it in our store and we sell it. Okay? Okay? 
So for now, Ben, teacher will say goodbye and I will see you on Sunday 7.25. Okay? Okay. Okay, bye, bye Ben. Bye. Good night. Bye. Oh, tell me to your father. You say to your father happy birthday from teacher Anne, okay? A greetings okay. from teacher Anne to your father. Happy 42nd birthday. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Good night, Ben.